And when there are blurred lines, there is that risk of the harassment complaint. And then potentially hashtag me too. More and more folks are identifying as non-binary. They're identifying as transgender. Ontario now is issuing a third gender on birth certificates. If your staff is not prepared to greet this guest without using sir or ma'am, you could be in trouble. The reality is that the future is fluid. Now, I remember when it was just gay. When I came out 25 years ago as a freshman in college, it was gay and lesbian. But they keep adding more letters. I don't know who they is, but there are more and more letters, right? LGBT, LGBTQIA+. Facebook allows people to submit whatever gender they want. It's a blank spot. Anyone can type in their gender. Literally infinite genders, according to Facebook. And not only that, but Facebook allows folks to tell the world what their pronoun is. So why does this matter? It matters because those Generation Z and millennial workers value equality. More than any other trait your company has to offer, they value equality. They want to know how you're treating your workers. They want to know how you're treating clients and your guests. That's what matters to them. And beyond that, these folks, these younger employees, are increasingly diverse. We do it all the time. We assume gender based on someone's voice on the phone, based on how they might look. And yeah, you are going to have some people who are like, mm, I don't know about this. What does this mean? Where do I fit? What is even a pronoun? I haven't heard that word since third grade, right? Why are we talking about pronouns? You're gonna get a little bit of that. You might have some coworkers who are like, mm, I don't know if this is gonna fly with our crowd. Trust me, the future is fluid. This is one more way to be inclusive. So what does this mean that we're all little delicate snowflakes or that I'm asking you to prance around on eggshells around the office, that work can't be fun anymore, you can't just be yourself? That's boring. That's not what I'm asking. The cost for these things is virtually zero. The return is priceless because you're creating a more inclusive environment. I was blown away with the genuine emotion, the genuine care, um, the information that she gave, um, you know, with the history and what's going on and uh, things that are going on today and how we can go ahead and apply that to make our clients feel more comfortable, which again is my most important aspect. Um, it was very helpful to me because there were a lot of things I learned from her about verbiage and language and how to properly market that because it's her expertise, I hadn't really thought of, so it was wonderful for me to have that aspect of it as well.